everyone and welcome. This is Melissa Arma with the Stock Swish and reviewing the overall market. So today the market gap down, dropped, fell, now we're pushing back again. It's a very sloppy day to trade actually on this Monday. The market gap down Friday night. Ironically, the news came out about Moody's downgrading U.S. debt after the close. Going into a weekend on a Friday night, of course I say it ironically, but it's really not that ironic. Not even uh, surprising actually, but really low volume in the market today. We had a huge breakout in the market on Friday. So far, we're not holding it very well. Will we hold it? Won't we hold it? You know, this is an environment, and I was talking about this this morning in the trading room. We only have a little bit more than a month left, about a month and a half left in 2023. So the market, I've been saying this for the last, you know, 10 months, market isn't going to make new highs for the end of the year. So... You know, when you look at the overall market, you say, where do we go into 2024? Well, nobody really knows. Remember, 2024 is an election year. Typically, in election years, with the exception of 2020, because it was COVID, so the market was rocked with volatility because of COVID, typically, an election year is pretty, pretty quiet until after the election. 2016 was that way. But that being said, my take on 2024 is going to be that it's going to be extremely volatile, pretty much since the start of the year for the whole year up running into the election for so many reasons you know we have two world wars going on across overseas ukraine and russia and then the issue in gaza and israel that's gonna both of those issues are going to carry into 2024. they also affect oil prices and rising interest rates so you know the problem with rising interest rates is going to carry into 2024 and then of course all the economic data that normally comes out if you're someone that trades the market and you have no idea what to do on any given day and, and you're looking at news and you're saying good news or bad news or bad news or good news or you're using prior trends where you could say, well, if we have good news, we fall. Or if we have bad news, we rally or vice versa. It's not going to be a year like that where things are going to be what you would consider normal, normal patterns or normal things like that for the market. When I'm looking at the overall market, I'm constantly, constantly, constantly focused on the gap. That allows me to see where the stock's going to go, where the market's going to go. And again, even if I don't trade the market every day, I look at the market every day to see what it's doing to make determination about decisions, about trades I may be in, taking, or want to take, or want to get out of fast or hold. And so again, today, we're nowhere. Low volume, nowhere, gap down today, trying to recover, not going anywhere higher, and waiting on the rest, rest of the week, which we have some significant data out this week. But, you know, looking at 2024, and my point of this video today is that 2024 is going to be an extremely volatile year to trade. It is an election year. There's also a lot of focus on interest rates. And when you look at that overall and the other things that are happening, again, geopolitically in the world, you have to say, do you know what you're doing? In the stock market if you're risking money because if you don't know how to trade and you don't know what you're doing you don't know what you're investing your money in you are going to lose i had someone that emailed me last week this person is not a client whether or not he will become a client i do not know he's considering it however he was telling me that he has had a rough couple of months and 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 i asked him what he was trading and i said no wonder he's been swing trading okay he's not getting the follow-through to the upside or the downside that he would what he would like and i'm not surprised that he's down because the market has been choppy sideways. And again, if you don't know the select points, if you want to trade the market, if that's what you want to focus on, if you want to trade the market ETFs, if you don't know the select points to train them and hold them, you're not going to make money trading the market. Or if you don't know how to find selective picks, like we did Tesla, it was a huge trade last week. If you don't know how to find selective picks, stock picks to trade those picks and not do anything with the market, you're going to have a hard time making money in 2024 or even the, between now and the end of the year in 2023. So again, what I'm trying to say is that volatility will be on tap in 2024 and that allows huge opportunity if you know what to trade, if you know how to trade. If you're, if you're somebody that's focused like me on the price analysis that's going on in the chart, it doesn't matter to me if this thing, that thing, the reason, whatever you want to say, the reason we're down this morning, the reason that we rally Friday, whatever, it doesn't matter. What matters is the price. That's how I make the analysis. And I'm doing everything that I do in the price analysis in the gap and the pre-market. So I get up in the morning and I rate the gap. I rate the gap. If the gap rates 20 points or more, I'm taking the gap in the direction of the gap. It's based on my Golden Gap 26-point rating system, and that's what I teach in my signature class, which I teach once a month. There's only two more classes this year one this weekend in november and one in december that's it 
and then the year is over and we're going into 2024. So if you think you wanna trade with me this year yet, or even into early 2024, you'd wanna do the class this weekend or in December to learn, ramp it up and get ready to have a fabulous 2024. Because I really think there's a lot of opportunity that's gonna exist in 2024, if you know how to trade, which luckily I do. But if you don't know how to trade, like I was telling you about that other gentleman, you are going to have a bad year in 2024 because it is going to be like a year, any, any other year you would have ever known. I mean, we already know that going into looking who the candidates are for both uh, the Republican and Democrat candidates. Who would have thought that we would have a rematch between Trump and Biden in 2020, four years from that? No, no one would have thought that. No, no gambler would have even bet that that would occur. And that is really how it's setting up. So we'll see what happens between now and the end of the year. I'm watching it closely. Again, good luck, people. If you're interested in learning how to trade, email me at melissa at thestockswish.com. Again, you can sign up for the Golden Gap class. It is $69.99. That's $6,999. Go to the website, www.thestockswish.com, and look at the website for class prices and email me with questions. Thanks, everyone. Have a great day.